Hello everyone. Welcome to latest update program. The topic of discussion is scheme for electric passenger cars. This topic relates to economy section of the UPS CCSE syllabus. Let's see why this is in news. Recently, the Ministry of Heavy Industries launched the application portal for the scheme to promote manufacturing of electric passenger cars in India. Attract investments from global EV manufacturers. Position India as a major player in EV production. Create jobs and further the Make in India initiative. Applicants can import E4W, completely built unit, or the CBRs with a minimum CIF, cost, insurance and freight, value of USD, 35,000 at a 15% reduced customs duty for five years from the approval date. It will attract investments from global EV manufacturers, position India as a major player in EV production, create jobs and further the Make in India initiative. Now let's discuss about the scheme to promote manufacturing of electric passenger cars in India. It is a forward-looking scheme to promote the domestic manufacture of passenger cars with a special focus on electric vehicles, EVs. The scheme aims to promote domestic manufacturing of passenger cars with a focus on electric vehicles, EVS. It supports the Make in India, Atmanirbhar Bharat initiatives. With a rupees 4,150 crore investment, the scheme encourages global and domestic companies to set up manufacturing in India, offering customs duty cuts and boosting EV technology and local capabilities. Now let's discuss about Make in India. It was launched to attract investment, foster innovation, promote skill development, protect intellectual property and build world-class manufacturing infrastructure. It was launched in 2014. The initiative aims to transform India into a global manufacturing and investment hub. It is led by the Department for Promotion of Industry and Internal Trade or the DPIIT under the Ministry of Commerce and Industry. Government of India. Make in India 2.0 has made significant progress across 27 sectors, including strategic manufacturing and services. Now is the time for practice question under the scheme to promote manufacturing of electric passenger cars in India or the SPMEPCI scheme. Which of the following is allowed for approved applicants? A. Import of CBUs, completely built units of electric vehicles with a minimum CIF value of 35,000 USDB. Import of raw materials for manufacturing electric vehicles, C. Import of electric vehicles without any duty, D. Import of parts for assembling EVs in India. Send the answer for this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.